shouldn't see me, shouldn't hear me. It was a clean kill. And none of it is going to go to waste. What's your name, Ranger? Italian. What were you? A lieutenant? No, actually, uh, I was a captain. Oh, my mistake! We have a captain in our midst! Well, better look sharp, eh? Captain's coming. Better sharpen the swords, eh? And make sure our boots are nice and shiny. <laughs> oh, so tell me, Captain. Have you ever hunted a Graug? A Graug has what you promised me. Aye. Not just any Graug. The largest one I ever came across. <sighs> we must prepare! I should do just fine. I've been trained very well. My dog, Silver, was trained very well. That was before she got eaten by a warg. Hunt! It's not about rules, my captain. We're not going to line up and have someone play with our lives. It's about instinct, and it's about guts. Which, as you can see, I know a thing or two about. <laughs> You want basics on the hunt. Follow me. The hunt is its own beast. One you must learn to tame. First lesson of Karagor hunting. Do not die. What do we need them for? We ride them. A worthy mount for a dangerous hunt. Now, these beasts will not be impressed by your rank. All flesh tastes the same to them. Once you go on the hunt, Captain, you'll come out a changed man. Hopefully for the better, but you never know. When I was hunting wargs, I picked up their ways quickly. But Caragors, well, those bastards are a tougher breed. Took me nearly a year to figure them out. Caragors. Bugs hate water. I once tried to ride one through a river, and she hightailed it up a cliffside with me on its back. Amazing what they'll do to avoid the good cleaning, eh? And the hunt is my mistress. Beautiful, thrilling, infectious. And she doesn't nag like my wife. Oh, you haven't lived until you've been on the hunt, Captain. The very air smells different. Like triumph. Ranger, over here! That one over there looks quite aggressive. Don't even try creeping up on a Karagor. It'll catch your scent a mile away. What do you propose, then? Why don't you hop in and introduce yourself? Ask it for a ride. about the same time it took me to tame one. You might be a natural, Captain. You didn't fare too bad back there. Where'd you get your training, Captain? I hail from the Black Gate. The Black Gate. Nice place. Sounds depressing. <laughs> Let's find some Uruks. Now that you tame the beast, let's see if it'll fight for you. 
Don't mess with that cop that I was with. Cutting off! Face I can take down more than you, Ranger! Even the fiercest beast can be. You've been hunting and learning for long, dwarf. For years and years. Land used to be more lush. Now a doom slowly sweeps over it. Like much of Mordor. Yes. Though the doom does add a space to the hunt. Surely. But can you shoot from one? You take him up high. Leave the ground dogs to me! Saw a crown of stars appear, a dim to turn a dim day above the shadows of his head. That fire better not set my beard to light. Said souls, if I see the light, you're coming. Oh. Now let's take on a fresh batch. We'll find another cow. Put you to a final test. Fight him however you like. Oh, running short on lessons? Running long on lip? You'll need to think on your feet. When we face the Grog, can't always look to me for help. The hunt is about discipline. Training yourself to see the perfect moment, rather than being told it. I once tracked a grey eagle back to her nest. I decided to let them be, even before they tossed me to the rocks below. How do you reckon the new boss? I haven't figured him out yet, but he looks tougher than the old. Swing your time for blood! He's already on me! <laughs> Torven needs help. I'll be twice as hard to
so you know, I had him. What does riding Karagors have to do with killing Graugs? All these questions, Captain. I thought you were supposed to follow orders. You are testing my patience, Tolvin. Pay attention. Learn to respect the beast. You're gonna need size and strength to fight the mighty Graug. Remember, on the hunt, respect is earned. Well, who knows? Maybe it'll even call you sir, eh? <laughs> This dwarf is far from home. Not all those who wander are lost. off by my wee scars. Oh, not at all. I actually have a few of my own. <laughs> oh, I'll bet. What type of battle scars did you get from the Black Gate, eh? Splinters! <laughs> oh, or did you uh, scar your voice telling your soldiers to head into battle? Tread lightly. My scars run very deep. Huh. The mighty Graug, he gave me these. And he also took my hunting partner. So, what now? Well, another lesson for you, my captain. <clears throat> Maybe you'll even come out of this one on Scar. <laughs> So, what backward lesson do you have planned this time, eh? Shooting Krabane to prepare us for the mighty Graug? You want to hunt Graug? Then so you shall. But not just any Graug. This is a rare one. It's territorial. Strong enough to claim land as its own. And you and me, we're trespassing. Tell me, Captain. You ever slay a Graug before? Today will be the first of many. Now you're talking like a hunter. I've got a feeling in my gut you may survive this, Captain. Well, since that's the largest part of you, I like those odds. So I assume you have a plan to kill this Graug? I do, Captain. And since you're so good at taking orders, I'll tell you how, step by step. Step one, when he's crunching on an Uruk, sneak up behind the giant beast and bleed the bastard's ankle. But why not his throat? There is one place Graugs aren't covered in spiky scales. They don't call a weakness a Graug's heel for nothing. You want me to sidle up to this beast? If you can manage it without being crushed, yes. There it goes. What a fine, fine specimen. And it'll meet a fine end. Ankle if I want to bleed it. Your speed will now match the ground. Scared to chase you? I'll be waiting. That will be quite a ride. I need a Karagor for speed. I need a Karagor for speed.
Easy enough. Step four! There is no step four! It should be dead! You must have done it wrong! I'm following your orders! Well, that's your problem! Think for yourself! I have an idea! You can't ride a frog! Step four! It should be dead! You must have done it wrong! I'm following your orders! Well, that's your problem! Think for yourself! I have an idea. Do it! You can't ride a croak! <laughs> Ends with the sting of my blade. See! I say, it's a wee bit unusual to ride a growl. It's nothing like a little improvising, eh? <laughs> All right, Captain. That's it. Should instinct, gumption, respect. <laughs> Training's over. Got guts. Let's go spill some, eh? Hey? The darkness of Mordor doesn't seem to touch that dwarf. Torvin! Heads up, Captain! <laughs> Time to go hunting! <laughs> I assume you know the path. The real question is, are you ready to travel it? Whatever happens during the hunt, think, what would Torvin do? Actually, that's a good life lesson for you to follow always. I pray your training sticks, or else you'll stick to the wall once the mighty Grog hurls you there. I'm ready to fight the Grog. And that's just what you do. Fight. No art, no finesse. 
The hunt isn't about swinging and slashing, it's bigger than that! From your perspective, Dwarf, everything is bigger. Yes, this Grog is very, very big! Oh, oh wait, you're mocking me. Graugs are one of the oldest species of Mordor, and the deadliest by far. It's been a long time since I faced this Graug. Let us hope time wasn't as gentle to him as it was to me. My old partner and I once tracked a Graug from Mount Dolmed to Nogrod. We finally slayed it and got stuck under his leg for two days. Ah, those were fun times. Last time I saw the beast was when my old partner and I tracked it into his dwelling. How did you get out alive? Luck. The growl knocked me senseless. When I came to, it had ended my partner. Facing that creature alone was a death sentence. I'd been hunting this growl for almost a decade. That's a lot of years of dedication to one beast. Dedication? Or a sign you preach better than you hunt? Oh, that's funny, Captain. I'll be sure to laugh when the beast eats you alive. The mighty Grau will be my legacy. Dwarves will tell tales of Torvan the Hunter for generations. And I'll have them throw your name in there somewhere. Whoa! The Caragors are too quiet. I don't think the Grog is home. <laughs> then we go in and we wait. An ambush? How military. I like it. An axe. That's just as sharp as the day our father made it. Just do as Torvin said. Rule number one, we... Never mind, we improvise! It's too strong! I must attack from afar! A shot to the skull will disorient him!
God, bastard! I think he's dead. <laughs> ah! 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 Well, that's what I call beast hunting, eh? Indeed, indeed. Next time I'm not gonna let you have all the fun. Oh, no, no. This is the last time I have other prey to pursue. Well, you need help on your journey, so what you say? We put no, some no, chance no, it's over. I have to do this on my own. If you survive, uh, come to the Blue Mountains, eh? <laughs> and lots of friends that will drink until their kegs run dry. I've seen how much a dwarf can drink. <laughs> I do hope our paths cross again. Right. Now, how do I get you out of here? <laughs> I hope that Torvin finds his way home, now that his hunt is over. If he does, then he will find his home is not as he left it. Make this Uruk scream, and his master shall answer. Explode Lauren's head! Ah! 
Demon. Demon. There's no way out unless you look forward to bleeding all over my boots. Oh, Miss Morcarago, missing bite. Maybe I should time you for you on a leash, eh? You'll never win! War is coming! Kill the herd, and the bull will charge. When I go into a fight, I always want a good hunter. Decomposing glory! Your bloody revolting! here and there. Face me and die! I've got him! No worm! 
Where I tread, nothing stands. Not even you. Only strength of stone survives the flood. Resist the war chief's waves, and he shall face us. Something just moved over there! I've got a lighter signal fire! Send out the bacon!
Horns fall, the king will emerge. Kill the war chief's vanguard. We wish to thank you for coming to our aid, Captain. Aye. Never realized my smuggling could be so appreciated by the Queen, <laughs> my lady. They're here. Orcs. Oh, they make bad passengers. But I've carried worse. My lady. That plank level! Boy, touch nothing! 
Queen Marwan. It's good to see you in better health. The boats are ready. The skippers have been briefed on your destination. Good. How long will those orcs obey you? Well, I should think as long as I like. I'm in your debt. We owe you our lives, Talia. Just put an end to this madness. My lady. Look at our numbers! Look at our strength! We are the Dark Lord's greatest weapon! And that shrug over there is our greatest enemy! Break his face! Drown the air with Uru cries and the earth with Uru blood! You filthy truck! Are you a man or just a coward? I'll end you. We are at the final reckoning, the fortress of the Black Hand. This is a trap. This silence taunts us. What sorcery is at work here? I wasn't expecting you. I hope my soldiers gave you a warm welcome. Where are you? Show yourself! This is the work of the Tower. The Black Hand went looking for you. But it will give me great pleasure to take you myself. <sighs> Ha, 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 ha. 
The Dark Lord forgives you, Celebrimbor. Return to him, and cast off this human corpse. Stand up and fight. There's no need, Ranger. <laughs> Celebrimbor is your curse. He chose you. Silence! And he can release you at any time. <laughs> yes, that's all you are, Ranger. A vessel for the Ringmaker. As you wish. What joy it is to fight such such pain, such a broken mind. I shall make you walk through the grave, grave again, and then again. There's no place to stay there. This was your doing! I should have died with my family. I thought, I thought you wanted you. revenge. I can leave you. But there is only one way to close the circle. The Black Hand remains. Not for long. None 
is in flames. We must return to Queen Marwyn. The Black Hand has been here. I can feel it. Luther. Come for you, Lord of Gifts. Feel the true power of the Grave Walker. Rebuilt. Mount Doom is aflame. The Fall of Men is here, and Sauron will conquer all.
Triumphant, the age of the Uruk is at hand. When Sauron gets his hands on you, you're gonna beg him to just throw you into the fires of Mount Doom! Day. All Uruk's kill! This will finish as it started, with shadow and flame falling on the Black Gate. The Hammer and the Tower are dead. Sauron is still weak. Without the power of the One Ring or the Ringmaker, he cannot take form. He will be trapped within Mordor, no more than an Eye of Flame bound to his Dark Tower. And at last I can die, and none will avenge me. I have a gift for you, Calibrimor.
Huh? The Dark Lord gave you a second chance. To stand by his side. Now I give you no choice. We shall be sealed together in death. So be it. Return to me, Ringmaker. <laughs> Sauron is dead. The hither shore is calling us. This is no longer our battle. I tried fighting you. It can't be done. Could you really rest for all of eternity? Knowing that you had the chance to stop him, but did nothing. The time has come for a new ring. 